Haziel, focus turns back to the Sports Direct Premiership this weekend with a visit of Lock Gall. What are you expecting from that game? Yeah, it's just, it, I think it will be a tough match just to break him down. Um, we expect them to be in the low block. Hopefully we can um, be crea creative enough to break him down and create a lot of scoring opportunities. And you've enjoyed a strong first half of the season personally, settling in quickly in that defensive midfield role. Do you feel like you're starting to show your best form at this moment? Yeah, I feel like within games, when you start playing each and every game, you feel more comfortable with the team. I feel completely comfortable with the team at the moment. I know the guys, well, what I need to do with my role, defensively and offensively. And I feel great. I feel I feel like it's it's another home for me. Um, even though I'm away, it was a, long, a long way from home. But um, yeah, I feel comfortable. I feel strong. I feel fast. I feel um, physically great. And I think that comes within games when you have um, wake and wake out 90 minutes. I feel you feel great about it. And that's one of the things I came here to do. And and it shows that we've been winning a lot of games. And. Um, since I've been here, um, I haven't lost a game, <laughs> thank God. But um, no, nah, I feel great, yeah. And having been unbeaten in the Sports Direct Premiership since September, there seems to be that hunger to just keep winning and picking up maximum points. Oh yeah, it's for sure. It's just after each and every game we'll get a win. It feels great. And you, you would just look back to what, what's the rest of the season. It's just say hopefully 11 more league games and hopefully 14 games in total with the cup and once we as a group we look into just winning each and every game taking one game at a time but each and every game taking taking it like it's another cup final or to a final uh, as it is um it's i feel we're in a great spot right now um as in the cup or in the league and we just keep on having that winning mentality and off the pitch as well here in training. And with their last defeat in the Sports Direct Premiership coming at the hands of tomorrow night's opponents, it shows how competitive the league is and the need to be at the top of your game to always pick up three points. Well, I believe is that when you play um, the bottom six teams, it's hard to break them down and it becomes a patient game. It's mind, mind, mind games uh, for the full 90 minutes. Once you get to break them down and get an early goal or uh, goal in the half, that's when you get more confident, gain more confidence, and you feel a little more free on the pitch. Um, but yeah, it's it's you can tell when you if it's the first top six or bottom six, it's always a, it's a, it's an unpredictable game you could say. And but I feel we're and we're prepared enough to do it. And only as you mentioned earlier, only eleven games remain in in the league. Is it a matter of just taking it a game at a time and hoping to build on that? Winning mentality. I think we just need to remain calm in the squad that we're on. Be, um, be patient of um, when the games are coming in, but as well just taking that 100% um, mentality in each and one of them. Um, we want to win every game. We want to win um, the cup as well. And I feel like the team is having that hunger in when in each and every day in the in the training ground, the intensity that it, that comes within them, uh, the focus that we have like on video or just tactical wise when the gaffer's talking to us, I feel we're all set in and that shows in the pitch when you can just tell the record we have right now, we haven't lost a game in a while. Um, we we're trying to keep it that way and we're just trying to get one game at a time as well. Not really go full crazy um, and don't lose our patience or don't lose um, that bad mindset, but keep that um, strong mindset in, in terms of okay, we want to win the league, we want to keep winning the cup, and that's where we're at right now. And just finally, there's only three home games left in the league before the split, including tomorrow night. How important will the back of the supporters be at Ever Park this weekend and beyond? I feel it's huge. You just feel the, the crowd and the fans behind you. Um, when it's home game, it's all we play. It's, I feel, I always say that um, when it's a home game, when the home crowd is with you, it's tougher for the opponent. And when you have that um, home crowd and as well when we play away games, um, you feel like you're in, you're at Enver, you're in the home fans, you're with the home fans. Um, but now we really appreciate when they're when they're there and supporting us. And every time we're on the pitch, we know they're there and we, we know we're going to do well. Perfect. Thank you.